Robson knows that his team have got to improve and improve quickly after saving West Brom from the drop last season, something he described as the greatest achievement of his career. Here's Horsfield. Ellington close to him, was that handball? Big shout from Horsfield and 20-odd thousand West Brom fans. I think Everton are very lucky to get away with this. One-on-one, -on -one, Horsfield goes past Weir, Phil Neville covers back, raises his arm, certainly strikes his arm, and I think that was a penalty. Inamoto, good ball, Kanu, really strong there, Kanu, and now he sets it up for Ellington, brilliant, that will be a penalty. And Hibbert knew it, the moment he made the challenge. And will Nathan Ellington record his first ever goal in the Premiership? Yes, he will! A cool, cheeky, arrogant goal at that, and a very, very valuable one. It's in! And it's a terrific header to increase West Bromwich Albion's lead. Well, you were saying it in the first half, how dangerous Clement is from set pieces, and he's underlined it again. So either side of half-time now did... Kushak picked that one up outside the penalty area. I was going to say West Brom getting their goals either side of half time, but Kushak almost got them into trouble here. Well, Beatty seems pretty convinced that it's outside, and he's right. Carter, what a ball that turned out to be if he meant it. Kanu, right on the same goal alone this time, but he's picked out Ellington. That's a better effort. two goals, he's involved, he goes at Yobo, and he picks out Ellington, good control, Greening's on his right, he refuses to give it to Greening, because he knows exactly what he wants to do, that's to get it onto his left foot, and just bend it around Weir into the far corner, giving Nigel Martin absolutely no chance. This, a defeat that will knock them back into trouble again, and it could get worse here. Trademark celebration. The Matadors have killed off the ball, and West Bromwich Albion have one of their biggest ever Premiership victories in the back.